Now for the stronger geisha look, um, I'm going to be using the same thing, the super color uh, by Cryoland in white and I'm going to be using it with a sponge so for this we're going to go a bit stronger with a white um, just grabbing a sponge like that um, just basically I'm going to go quite far down all around So now that I put already this um, super color in white, um, I already put as well a little bit on the top. It's matched a bit there because I already had the black eyes, but if you're doing it from scratch, you should start off with the super color powder, um, which that's what I'm going to do now, and then do the eyes and all of the rest. So I'm powdering also with baby powder all around. Make sure to cover lips as well. Something that could be quite quite cool to enhance this look is something like, as if I've done here. So with a little brush, something like that, or something quite flat, you just grab a little bit of the white and um, you just literally just go sort of as, as a kind of like just a line. There you go. As if you, you know, as if you put the concealer on and then just do the line up this way. That will enhance a lot more the eyes. There you go. And then that you can actually sort of um, sort it out with your fingers as well. It's quite easy to do. So it's just following the line of your eyeliner basically. And with that, you just basically blend it out, blend the edges out, but make sure to leave that line quite sharp that goes high. Here we go. Right. Perfect. Next, I'm going to do the um, blusher, and I'm going to be doing it with Dolly Mix by MAC. It's quite bright, as you can see. And literally I'm just gonna grab this just be quite cautious with this and then give me a little smile and make sure to put it like in the apple of the cheek as well I mean you can just do your contouring with just the pink or you could do it sort of like right there a little bit higher a bit on the cheekbone and a bit on the uh, um, on the contouring, sort of all mixed. You can also put a little bit of um, blusher on this part here and that will give a bit more creativity and colour to your geisha. Go. And then finally, um, we're going to do the lips, which we're going to do sort of like the heart lip. Um, and it's quite easy. Just make sure to follow the line, you know, this heart line. By using a, a, a lip liner, it will be easy to easier to create this heart kind of heart shaped lip. There is the shape, and then Finally, I'm just going to grab the lipstick straight away and then you can use it with a brush. In this case, I'm just going to use the natural shape of the lipstick.
here you go. And that is the finished look of the geisha. Make sure you go down the neck. Also you can do some like, you know, you can do some extra bits, like for instance you can grab the, the grey eyeshadow if you want to make it even more intense and just um, with a little brush like that, sort of like a blending brush, you can just go and do a bit of a definition into the eye around like this area, just like that. And that will make your socket, eye socket, more defined. Or you can also go down this way as well. Just down the line from there and just go. Just make a line, straight line from the eyebrow up to the tear gland with a dark grey or you can do it with a black as well, that's no problem. And then you can have that kind of look as well. Make sure to blend it really, really well. If you're using creams, make sure to powder really well so that you can use both creams and powders really nicely. So, yes, here we go. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye-bye.